welcome back to Diamond Society. Now, as you can probably guess, I'm not at my base right at the moment. I'm actually out here at what I was doing for Pokenoggin. See here, make sure I've got my... Okay. Well, before I do that, I'm going to eat. Because in this box right here, we have all of the sheep heads. Every one of them, including some strange rainbow colored sheep head. And what I thought I would do with this that back up. I would take and I also have a few extra heads. Pick that up. I thought I would leave this area exactly almost kind of like what I found it in. With the exception of the house, the fencing, the torches. And one little special surprise that's behind this door. Now, if somebody wants to come and find out what's behind door number one here, you're more than welcome to what's in there. But if you need sheep, there's a pair of sheep right there to breed up so that you can get the different colors. And there's stuff in this chest. I can't carry it, but I'm not gonna worry about it. But for now, Let's go ahead and head back to my base, wherever it might be. Oh, it's good to be home. It's... Oh, looks like someone came and picked up their horse finally. Ah, babysitting fee. <laughs> All right, some redstone. Can never have enough redstone. Also, speaking of gifts, this is from Raminora, so thank you for that, and horse armor. Eventually, I will have to get myself a horse. That was supposed to go in my inventory. Let's go ahead and take this down. But as I was saying, speaking of gifts, I have a few other things that I should share with you guys. Now, obviously, <clears throat> excuse me, the first one, go ahead and close up our stairwell there. Our first one that you'll see is, I don't remember that being there the last time I was here, is BC dropped off the Poconoggin banner. <laughs> so thanks, BC. <laughs> I love that. I love having banners on the wall like that. And something else I learned is I didn't realize these actually move, even though there's no wind current in here. The other thing that I got a while back and forgot to share is Mott came by, I wish I could hold my hand still, and dropped off a Nimrod. And we proceeded to put him in the crane. So the crane now has an operator. Um, um, okay, I now have, would you stay up there? Thank you. Okay, let's see what this is. Uh, dear Leowen, I'd like you to come and have a chat with me as soon as possible. Otherwise, things will be revealed about you. Amos. Um, hmm, I've heard things about this Amos character before, but I, I don't know what to make of that. So we're gonna we're gonna put this away somewhere, and we're, we'll go talk to him right away. Cause yeah, there's. That doesn't that doesn't sound very good at all. So here we're gonna we're gonna deposit that in there. That way nobody can 
question me later about it. And we'll go ahead and pull down the item frame because we don't need that up there no more. And I am going to go have a uh, talk with Amos to see what kind of thing he wants to discuss. Oh, I wonder what Amos wants. This can't be good, that's for sure. And I'm just wondering how he found out about that certain little secret that I've been holding on to. Yeah. Let's see what he wants. Where is he? Okay. Lewin, I'm sorry I missed you. But I had some things that needed to be taken care of. However, that does not mean you're off the hook. I have heard you're removing the heads of heads from the local wildlife. And as such, I think what I want to ask you will fit your challenge very well. I want to construct a head statue of me in the docklands to welcome new arrivals. <laughs> you will do this for me, or you will do this. You must do this, or your secret will be revealed for all to see. I know you will not fail. Amos. Um, let's just go ahead and take that, and that, and let's head back to the Docklands and build ourselves a little statue. Because... We don't want people to know what's going on yet, I don't think. They might not even appreciate what's going on. So I'll catch you guys when I get back to the other side.
see what this looks like now when it's fully, fully, fully completed. Let's just make sure I can hit the right button, and bam! Oops. Don't pull up the inventory screen when you want to look at something. There we go. That should make him relatively happy. As he now has the four faces of fear. I mean, the four faces of Amos. <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah, there's, there's a drop off there, stupid. <laughs> Gotta watch your step. But. With that, I think I'm going to go ahead and call this just a quick little ep er, episode update of sorts, since we've got that all taken care of now. Our next project is going to be behind the wall, or beyond the wall, whichever way you want to put it. But hopefully you guys like the episode. I will catch you later, and until next time, have fun.